deal with the authority figures. And I'm the type of dude that wasn't going to take no nothing from nobody because I demand respect. But to the authority figures that's, that thought they had all the authority over me, I say, how do I get them to respect me? I walk with the table. I continue to try to grow. I'm what you do with respect. In order for me to want to demand respect, I got to give respect. So my whole incarceration, I never got a ticket. I never been to the hole or none of that because I had to get an authority figure in my life. And at that time, respect, no matter if I felt it was beneath me or above me or whatever, it was a respect factor because that's what I demand. And that's what you got to do in your lives. Give respect. If you want to demand respect for yourself and have self-respect for yourself, you got to give it. So I gave that at all times. And I made it through like that. Was it the way you spoke to them? Or how did you convey that to them? Because usually they might have a negative, initial negative yeah. attitude towards the way The way I spoke to them, like they say, the way when they come in, even if they come in with a bad attitude, good morning. How's your day? I was your evening. I just kept it like that. I kept it respectable. And then I just stayed in my own lane at times. And they come to me, Mrs. Norton, how is your day? And I just build that report. And when I build that report with one CEO, they tell another CEO how, how I am. And then that's how the respect went both ways. And that was all good for me, you know. But uh, moving forward, I kept on fighting. I'm fighting to get out. Went through the appeal process all the way to the United States Supreme Court and continue to lose, 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 lose. But as I'm going through this process, I'm staying grown. I'm feeding my mind, I'm feeding my body, I'm feeding my spirit. And I'm, I'm growing and I'm doing this time with joy because now I say, I, have, I realize that I'm doing God's time. I'm not doing this justice system time. I'm doing God's time, so I'm gonna do this like this. And I, I continue educating myself like them guys, I was in college while I was in prison. And I'm here speaking to y'all on behalf of a lot of good men that's in there, because I told them I would. And I'm standing on my word. Got to be a man of your word. You got to have faith in yourself. And that's what I'm doing now. That's why I'm here today. I could have got out. And hold on, let me revert. Now, I still, I, I just got out 30 days ago. I'm not even supposed to be here. Through all the fighting and fighting I did to get out, all the lawyers, the lawyers, my family put together money for, I put together my money for, they didn't do the job. But come right before Thanksgiving, there's a judge that came to the prison I was in, and I was able, able to advocate for myself. How was I able to convey my message to that judge? By being respectful, by telling my story, and standing in my own truth. And that's what y'all got to do. Always stand in your truth. Don't let nobody speak for you. You speak for yourself with your head up, and you go, you go persevere. But I never gave up. Every lawyer I used to call me, like, that judge would never let you out. That judge, you would be in there until your time is served, blase, blase. That judge did unprecedented things when she met me and got me a father. What's up? I, I, um, you are on the early release? I'm on early release right now. Okay. I'm on early release right now. And I had to make uh, decisions upon that early release because I got right off before Christmas time. The money, I, I, I'm, I'm about to survive. I got a good woman that held me down, but really, I've been my own man for years. But uh, So I had choices to make. I got dudes that still in the streets and said, do you want this? Do you want that? On the negative side, and I said, no. Nah. But God worked so good in my life I got to introduce a man to a man like these. I got to introduce another group of men to where I can come do things the right way, do things that I said I wanted to do. I didn't let the temptation get me. Never let the temptation get y'all. Right. Do what's right. Stand in your truth. <coughs> Make your people proud. See, I wish there was a lot more older uh, teenagers here, but we all young men will be the older teenagers that can change what's going on in our communities right now. And it's good that y'all here, because in a few years, y'all be the 18 year olds, and but y'all can be doing great things. Do that, do what y'all can do. I'm not gonna hold y'all too much longer, but it's something that I stood by in there. It's a quote, and I want y'all to wake up 
And I want y'all to repeat it after me with a conviction. Let y'all voices be heard. Feel it. And then take heed to this, man, because it's very important. I'm going to say it line by line, and I want y'all young men to say it with me. Unless you associate with some people. Hello, hold on, hold on. Young man, stand up. I need stand up. Stand up. Stand I up. go. Stand up. We waking up. Okay. I go. My, my little brother going to bless y'all with a song. But I want y'all to, uh, y'all got to feel this, man, because who you communicate with is important, man. You can't just communicate with anybody, man. Listen, unless you associate with some people, the more your life will improve. Unless you associate with some people, the more your life will improve. Okay, I'm going to slow it down. Anytime you tolerate mediocrity in others, anytime you tolerate mediocrity in others, it increases your mediocrity. It increases, it increases your mediocrity. And an important attribute of successful people, an important attribute of successful people, is their impatience with negative thinking, is their impatience with negative thinking, and negative acting people, and negative acting people. As you grow, as you grow, your associates will change. Your associates will change. Some of your friends will not want you to go home. Some of your friends will not want you to go home. They will want you to stay where they are. They will want you to stay where they are. Friends that don't help you to climb. Friends that don't help you to climb. They will want you to crawl. They will want you to crawl. Your friends will stretch your vision. Your friends will stretch your vision. Or choke your dreams. Or choke your dreams. Those that don't increase you. Those that don't increase you. Will eventually decrease you. Will eventually decrease you. Never receive counsel from unproductive people. Never receive counsel from unproductive people. Never discuss your problems with someone incapable of contributing to the solution. Never discuss your problems with someone incapable of contributing to the solution. Because those who never succeed themselves, because those who never succeed themselves, are always the first to try to tell you how. Are always the first to try to tell you how. Now everyone has the right to speak into your life. Not everyone has the right to speak into your life. You are certain to get the worst of the bargain. You are certain to get the worst of the bargain. When you exchange ideas with the wrong person. When you exchange ideas with the wrong person. Don't follow anyone who's not going anywhere. Don't follow anyone who's not going anywhere. With some people you spend an evening. With some people you spend an evening. With others you invested. And with others you invested. Be careful when you stop to inquire. Be careful when you stop to inquire. For directions along the road of life. For directions around the road of life. Wise is the person who fortifies his life. Wise is the person who fortifies his life. With the right friendships. With the right friendships. If you run with wolves, if you run with wolves, you will learn how to hide. You will learn how to hide. If you associate with eagles, you associate with eagles, you will learn how to soar at great heights. You will learn how to soar at great heights. A mirror reflects a man's face. But what is he but what he is really like is shown by the kind of friends that he chooses. But what he really like is shown by the kind of friends he chooses. The simple but true fact in life. The simple but true fact in life is that you become like those who you closely associate yourself with. For the good and the bad. For the good and the bad. Be not mistaken. Be not mistaken. This is applicable to the family, as well as friends. As well as friends. Yes, do love and appreciate. Yes, do love and appreciate. And be thankful for your family. And be thankful for your family. For they will always be your family. For they will always be your family. No matter what. No matter what. Just know that they are human first. Just know that they are human first. And though they are family to you, and though they are family to you, they may be a friend of someone else. And will fit somewhere in the criteria above. And will fit 
somewhere in the right here above. And prosperity, our friends know us. Prosperity, our friends know us. In adversity, we know our friends. In adversity, we know our friends. Never make someone a priority. Never make someone a priority. We are only an option for them. We are only an option for them. If you are the one to achieve excellence in big things, if you are the one to achieve excellence in big things, you develop the habit of little matters. You develop the habit of little matters. Excellence is not an exception. Excellence is not an exception. It's a prevailing attitude. It's a prevailing attitude. Y'all hold that. And we're going to, no, that's it. That's it. I, I want y'all to hold on to that right there. And, and we're going to try to get y'all a copy of that. And y'all read that. And y'all own that, man. Don't be mediocre, be mediocre to nobody. Never give up. Always believe in yourself. Put all that in your bag that all these brothers gave you. Just know, be you though, man. Hold your arm, hold your head high at all times and keep on stumping and never give up, man. And I love y'all, man. Yeah. Yeah.